before I start this, just something I want to say. We got we got a somewhat sponsor for this video. This video is sponsored by Heathen Intelligence. That's right. Heathen Auto though contacted me and said, "Hey, yo, Aaron, can you sponsor this? Can you sponsor us in your video?" I said, "Yeah, sure. Why not?" Yeah, this video is sponsored by Heathen Intelligence. But uh, by the way, I'm kidding. It's not sponsored. YouTube, please don't take down this video. It's all a joke. Okay, so, hello, everybody. My name is Bokusatsu, and today we are going to review the Tomashi Nation SA Figure Arts Kamen Rider Zero One. Now, this guy came out in 2019. Yes, he's two years old, I know. And I just bought this guy, like, like, ding. Two weeks ago, and I was supposed to do a review for him that week, but I was busy with work and all that stuff, and yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. So, I'm here now, and we're going to review this guy. So, first off, uh, first off, first off, first off, I want to say, I love how bright the colors are. Now, I don't have a black light. Sadly, if I had a black light, I would have used that to show you guys a cool uh, trick that this figure does in the dark. But sadly, I don't have one though, so <sighs> complete rip. But besides that, the colors are bright, which I do like. Cause he is a he is a, a grass <laughs> he is a grasshopper. Okay, let's look at let's look at articulation. Boop. Look at the ab crunch. Look 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 at the ab crunch right there. His, his head can spin to 360. This is how oh, this is how far he goes for his arms. See, this is how far he goes. For that, his leg articulation. Oh well, that's great. A little skinny, but that doesn't matter. You guys know, y'all know you can pose him, right? You can pose and do anything you want. Rising Hopper. I'm not good at my poses at times, so I'm sorry. This is this this is all I can do for now. Oh great. I am horrible. Sorry, I'm sorry, sorry, I'm sorry guys. This guy just saw about that. This guy is so fun to play around with. This is like my what my, my like my second Weiwa figure art. No joke. This is my second Weiwa Weiwa Kamen Rider in, in the figure figure. Ah, this is my second Weiwa Kamen Rider figure art in the Weiwa era right now. First was Vulcan, which I have over here, but I would use it for a size comparison. So so let's talk about so let's talk about quality. Now you can see this looks just like everything you see from the show. The paint apps, the scope, all that. One problem which is annoying, which is sadly, but I can take care of that, is this. Th you see this is the progress key. It have a grasshopper logo on it, right? Really enough, it does not have any stickers. But well, don't worry, SHF Upgrade had me cover for that. I'm not gonna go buy that, but yeah, they do have stickers for that. So if you wanna put that on there, this look just this look just like zero one from the show. The driver is clean. The articulation is good. 
the color scheme, all great and wonderful. Pretty fun. Definitely a fun figure to play around with. So let's go on to oops. let's go on to size compare. No, okay. We got a session before we go on to size comparison. You have a lot of hand, a lot of hands, so nothing else. Oh, by the way, I do have zero one sword, his briefcase sword, but I put that up in Volk in uh in my Vulcan box. So yeah. So, we have these hands for his pose that his zero one does. Well, yeah, we have these hands that we do for the pose that zero one does. We have a couple of open, we have, we have a couple of hands that you can put his uh, saber in, put his saber on. So, there's that. I recommend you to uh, put the saber on his hand if you have the Vulcan figure. And here are his open, you know, here are his fisted hands. Ooh, he's fisted here. <laughs> yeah, he, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. Yeah, he, eh, oh, well, eh, okay, wonderful. Sorry about that. Yeah, he, he doesn't come with a lot, but that still doesn't. That, but yet, that still doesn't concern. That still doesn't concern the fact that he's still a good figure. So right now we're gonna go on the size comparison. Here he is right next to Vegeta. And here it is right next to the SA Figure Arts Vulcan. Another character from Zero One. Overall, he's standing pretty well with both of them. Well, Vegeta's a little shorter, but. Well, yeah, Vegeta, Vegeta may be a little shorter, but overall, he stands pretty well with both of them. I may just put Vulcan in the freaking background. So please forgive me. So here is anyway, some lightning collection with Psycho Red. And here he is with the uh, uh, lightning collection in Space Red. If you want to do like a picture shot with Kamen Rider or Super. Come right with Power Rangers, or you want to call it Super Sentai, you go ahead and do it because they work pretty well with each other. Not in, not in size, not in scale, but they do work pretty well with each other for like picture wise. Okay, here it is, right next to his predecessor, Comrade Zio, the, the last season of Heisei Era. <laughs> The last season of the Heisei era. Before this guy was a thing, we had we had him. So yeah. He said pretty well with them. So yeah, that's all. That's all for this video. Hope you guys pre like, comment, subscribe. Post notifications on. Follow my Instagram at Brookasachi. Follow my Vimeo account. I do cool, awesome comrade stuff on there. I forgot what I do. Okay, I do parodies. I do like AMVs and all of that. So, thanks for watching. My name's Aaron, and I'm out. Peace.